Welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to be tackling my daughter's room. Um, as you can see, it is a hot mess. It looked a lot worse than this because the crib wasn't attached or anything. Everything was just leaning against the walls. And I felt like, like when I entered the room, I was just stepping on toys, which I am kind of just a little bit, um, not as bad, but today I just want to kind of clear and put toys away. I want to go into the closet and kind of go through some of my daughter's clothes um, and see what fits her and what doesn't. I want to go through some toys and see what we can either donate or sell. Um, I don't know where to begin in this room. Um, I'm thinking maybe it just should start with the toys or something because I don't know. I feel like there's so much that I just feel like it is overwhelming. Um, my daughter is in the living room right now. She's watching a movie, so kind of keeping her occupied so that she doesn't come in here and take all the toys out, which she will. But I just want to kind of like pick up the room a little bit, go through as much as I possibly can, and then hopefully we'll get some clothes and toys bagged up and that way we can like donate them i will try to sell them if they don't sell them i'm just gonna donate them that's what i normally do and there she is okay so let's go ahead and get started
to this I don't know how to act, don't know how to adapt to this situation Not used to this, no I'm not I better let myself Give in to love, believe in us No matter what it does to my heart Not used to this, no I'm not It was like if we were to waste These moments The like poets to me Okay, so this, she got this for her second birthday, and I don't know who bought it, but it's like hand, hand sanitizer and everything, like foam wipes, antibacterial wipes, or hand sanitizer wipes, whatever, and it says 8 plus, so I'm like, who buys this for a two-year-old? Like, I don't know. So it hasn't been opened. I'm gonna get rid of it. I thought about keeping it, but I was like, 
I have hand sanitizer and everything. I'm like, she doesn't need it. Um, like, unless she's going to school and things like that. So I'm getting rid of that. Um, she also has like unboxed like birthday gifts and everything. I might save these. Um, I might get rid of them. This one is for three plus. It looks like it has like putty or something in there, which I wouldn't allow her to play with that because only because she likes to put things in her mouth. So I wouldn't trust her with that. Um, this, I got this for her, I think, what was it? Her first birthday. And her theme was um, Beauty and the Beast. So it is, if I can take it off, oh my gosh. But anyways, it's just the rose and it lights up. It has a USB, so I'm going to try to sell this one as well. Um, we'll see uh, how things go. Like I said, um, I'm going to try to sell them first and see if anyone like wants them. And if not, then I'm just going to give them away. So, yeah. Um, well, actually, before I put those in there, let's get these out see this size is okay has no size <laughs> and okay this thing came off so I wouldn't know if this was her or not I might have to like put it up against her to see so she has like all these headbands that she has never worn one thing I don't get is that people will buy like bows right and nothing with all her clothes didn't match same thing with her pants nothing matches so I'm like I don't know what that goes with like I bought her a headband for the 4th of July for her very first 4th of July this thing did not fit her big head <laughs> And I've been looking for these little underwear, you know, to put under a dress. I have no idea where it goes, like what dress goes with it because I don't have anything that's like this, you know, um, polyester, yeah, fabric. So I don't know where this even goes to. This was, I think I might keep this one or because she went to home, she went home with, with it on with her little outfit. So I think I'm going to keep that one just as a, like a memory thing. Um, okay. So this one is a 3T. So I'm going to keep this one. This is, let's see, what's this? This is 3T. Some other bows. Like it still ha like it still has a tag on it, so uh, I found one of her little clips. I've been trying to like look for these things all over the place. We have some sheets, so I'm gonna keep those. These are little sweatpants. These are three T, so I'll definitely keep these as well. Um, what's this one? It's like a little top, 3T, it's old navy. Don't know who got out of that. Some more headbands. This actually goes with an outfit that she, um, has. Um, so I'll keep that one. I'll probably keep some of these. I mean, this one's kind of stretchy. Um, just in case, you know. Uh, but majority of these, like, I think this outfit was one of her newborns but these i'm just like i'm not keeping these were little ponchos i got this at the 909 market i thought it was so cute and then this one was handmade by my husband, Tina, and she did wear it for her first birthday um, since it was a bell. So I wanted her, you know, something yellow. So I thought it was really cute. So I'm going to keep those. And a sticker. <laughs> I'm going to have a sticker. 
So that's the majority of the stuff. Like these headlamps, I'm gonna um, give out. I might keep this pink one. She did wear this one for her like one of her photos that I ended up taking when she was just a baby, but it was all big on her. Okay, so that. I actually thought I had more toys to like get rid of, but I guess not. So my hernia is starting to hurt. This is why I have to take it easy because then it starts to hurt. So I now have an empty, empty box, which I don't know what I'm going to do with them. I'm just going to put it up there for the meantime. And then we are going to go and try to like transition the clothes onto the other side. So let's see. You know that we shouldn't keep it up like this We hurt each other's feelings on and on your heavy breath through darkness the smoke is getting close to my bed i cannot make that sound empty lungs sleeping but i wait paralyzed don't come over me yet cause i'ma let you i'ma let you in through my ear yeah, i'm a baby yeah. and you will let me go be a little bit more organized i don't know what i'm gonna do with the toys i'm just gonna kind of like leave those there for right now um i still have things up there so i'm gonna try to get them if i can um i don't know what i'm gonna do with her books um she has a lot of books so right now like this is a full box of books books are here i have books right there I think there's a couple up there so I'm gonna try to like combine all the books together so that way she doesn't destroy them I just I might have to put them somewhere like underneath here I might get that big box I don't know we'll see and then just kind of put all the books together so that way she is not destroying them because she does like to eat the paper and rip them and you know and then she'll get like something like a normal kid would you know so yeah um, I don't know what to do with that right now because, and my daughter like loves to play dress up. So I would like to find something that would, um, hold like all her, her dresses and accessories and things like that. So that way, you know, when she wants to wear all this, <laughs> she can, so. <laughs>
So, so far I removed all the boxes, diapers, um, for the baby. This just needs to be moved over here on the other side and I emptied everything off. I did put the wipes up there. Um, I want to get more stuff like for organizations, but depending on how much the baby gets, um, we'll see. <laughs> and on this side, um, I'm going to leave that up there for the meantime. I don't need it right now so i'm just gonna leave that i did move melanie's like um winter stuff you know it's summer right now and then some of the toys that just need to be organized that's a part of the bassinet her clothes and then just whatever that needs to be but wait that's her bed sheets and all stuff so we are gonna wait on that 
some toys and then I'm gonna have my husband move this over here or if I can try to do it um, it's pretty heavy so so far it looks a little bit better okay so I am kind of done for today my hernia is definitely hurting now <laughs> I think I did make some progress um, I packed the bag um, full of clothes and toys that you know I can donate or sell and then um, other than that it's just like random stuff that just need to be put away <laughs> my daughter is in here right now so she's playing on her VTEC um, little toy I ended up bringing the bar stool out the or the little stool she was standing on that before that's why I took it away and I've had it in the closet so we'll see how she does um, for the meantime it's just gonna look like this I'm gonna take out the boxes have my husband throw them, throw them out um, this box is just, like I said, it's just, um, blankets. So I'm just going to probably push that in here so it doesn't fall or she doesn't, you know, mess around with it just in case it, you know, but the closet for the meantime, I'm just going to leave it as it is right now. Um, I, I still need to organize it. So that might be another video. Um, so hopefully the next time when we come back. The room will look a little bit different more stuff will be in here so yeah. we'll see this is just part of it <laughs> but i really wanted to get in here and clean it as much as i can so <sighs> i hope you guys yeah. liked the video and if you guys did please give me a thumbs up um i will see you guys next time bye <laughs>